Let's graph a line with a slope of one-third and a y-intercept of zero. We'll start by writing the equation using slope-intercept form, y equals mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. In this case, m equals one-third and b equals zero. Substituting these values into our equation, we get y equals one-third x plus zero, which simplifies to y equals one-third x. Now, let's create our coordinate system and graph this line. Here's our x and y axis. We know our y-intercept is at the origin point zero zero, and our slope tells us that for every three units we move, right, we go up one unit. Let's plot some points using this pattern. Starting from the origin, if we go right three units and up one unit, we get the point three one. Going right three more units and up one more unit gives us six two. We can also go left from the origin. Going left three units and down one unit gives us negative three, negative one. And going left six units and down two units gives us negative six, negative two. Now, let's connect these points to form our line. Notice how our line passes through the origin and follows the slope of one third, meaning it rises one unit for every three units it runs. To verify our graph, we can check that the line passes through the origin our y-intercept, the line has a positive slope moving up as we go right. And for every three units we move horizontally, we move one unit vertically, giving us our slope of one third. And there we have it. We've successfully graphed the line, y equals one third x using slope intercept form. Remember, the slope tells us how steep the line is, and the y-intercept tells us where the line crosses the y-axis.